Hi, welcome to the new video. Uh, today I'm doing the uh, picture as shown on the right side. It's a skull with a rebel flag painted on it. Uh, as always, black and white is opaque colors and the other colors are transparent. I'll start with the white for the skull. Uh, then I'm switching to the opaque black. So everything in this stencil is painted black. So this is uh, number two of the um, school flags. Um, number one was the normal American flag and this is the rebel flag and the uh, Northern Brothers, the Canadian, is coming in the next video. Now this is the grey. So if you've seen the um, American flag, you notice that and now I have worked a little bit darker at the outside of the skull. I have switched now to the the red airbrush. And now you can see the, the candy colors. Everything that's white gets the full color where I have put the gray tone. Then you get a darker red tone. So this is now the dark blue. And also there you can see that uh, parts where I used the the or uh, the the gray the, the the blue also gets darker there. And finally uh, the white. This is the white for the flag. I have another white for the actual skull. And there you have this. So it's recommended that you use one and two again, so that uh, uh, two and three, so that you put like a gray and a black over the flag. So you get more variations in the flag stands alone. Now comes the final white. I just concentrated too much on uh, finding the position in the teeth. If you took the the eyes and the, the the bow there, then it would be easier to position this. I'm not using the full white, just like 20-30%. Um, the full white should be reserved for the the white and the flag. So now I switch to the light blues to do some background colors. And I will use a little bit of green for the eyes. And then I'm finished. If you like this style, you can subscribe my channel for more videos. See you soon.